Tonight, Louisville's homicide unit is working on yet another case after a man was found shot inside a car. WDRB's Darby Bean explains how this adds to the unit's overwhelming workload. Darby. Just about an hour and a half ago, we learned new information about this investigation from police. LMPD says a person was found shot to death in a car off Elliott Avenue. The victim has not been identified, and this comes at a time when the city is nearing last year's record number of homicides. LMPD data shows that so far this year, there have been 171 homicides in Louisville. Last year, a record was set for the city with 173. Many family members are still searching for answers and reminding people about the loved ones that they've lost, like Lakeisha Jeffrey, whose 26 year old son, John Robert Johnson Jr. was killed last December. She says every time she hears of another homicide, her heart goes out to that family because she knows the pain is unmatched. It hurts. I, I hurt for them. I hurt for each and every mother and father um, who had to endure this tragedy. I mean, there are no words. There are still no arrests in her son's case. Today, LMPD told us that at least three of this year's homicides have now been ruled justified by the Commonwealth Attorney's Office. That's why our previous reporting had us closer to last year's number. Coming up tonight at 11, hear what former U.S. Attorney Russell Coleman calls the single greatest challenge Louisville is facing. Darby Bean, WDRB News. Okay, Darby, thank you.